Hello guys, and welcome back to my Pokemon Y Egglock. This is episode 17, and yes, this is episode 17, and I am Baraki XY. And I uh, derped a little bit, so I'm trying to hatch these eggs. And um, Caleb decided he wanted to talk to us, so let's see what he's got to say for himself. Here, take this. He's just going to give a surf, um, which is great. Oh, I have some interesting news while we uh, put surf in our pocket. I am coming to you right now from the comfort of my um, my uh, study, and I am coming to you through my new microphone. So I got um, some money for my birthday, and I went ahead and I've bought myself um, a new microphone, a proper microphone, uh, a blue microphone. So yeah, I feel slightly though like a radio DJ right now, <laughs> as I'm sat here with my pop filter and my big ass microphone. And um, I feel like I should be saying hello and welcome to Smooth Radio with your host, Baraki XY. Please kick back, relax, have a cup of tea and enjoy the show. So with that, with, with, with that being said, let's enjoy the show. Um, I've given myself hatching powers right now. Um, so because I've got two eggs to hatch, um, they're in my potty. They were, I can't remember, egg 82 and egg 140. Um... Neither of which need nicknames, so I'm free to nickname them as I would please. And as you can see, I'm not very good at riding my bicycle. Um, I just crash all the time. But anyway, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. As long as I don't destroy the egg. Eggs, eggs, I have two eggs. Oh no, oh, I've just got it in the house. Oh, my hatching powers have worn off. Better go ahead and give myself hatching powers again, because you know, that is what is very useful. It's really hard to do that with my finger. I need to find my stylus. Give. I don't want to use it. As you can see on my uh, screen, I um, I used it on myself before I gave it to myself last time because I'm such an idiot. Um, I'm so used to pressing use rather than give. So yeah, yeah, it's much better to um, use than to give. No, give than receive or something. I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, this is going to take ages, isn't it? I was like, I was just going to save this for when I was um, off screen, but then Caleb came along and totally ruined that plan. So let's see. How close are we? Do I need to pause this recording right now? Uh, 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 uh. Oh no, oh no, they're going to hatch. They're going to hatch soon, so that's, that's cool beans. So guys, how are you? How are you? Um, I am not too bad. Uh, unfortunately, um, yesterday I just had an absolutely, uh, I had a pretty awful day really. I had um, a whole bunch of migraines and um, it meant that I couldn't do Wonder Trade and I apologise for that so much because I really hate to let people down. Um, but there's, you know, I just needed to lie down in a darkened room. Anyway, so we've got the egg hatching, so let's see which, what's this going to be. What is this going to be? I'm excited. Who's got the egg hatching hype? Oh, hello. We have a phantom. Interesting. Interesting indeed. That's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah. I know exactly. I'm going to call it spooky tree. Because <laughs> now I'm, I'm going to forget who it is. But I was watching one of Trainer Artie's. In fact, I, I, I'm hoping it was one of her videos, where her drunken battle videos, and somebody had a spooky tree. Uh, I can't remember who exactly it was, um, so I have a very, very bad memory. But they had spooky tree, so we're gonna have spooky tree. Maybe one day spooky tree will evolve into a trevenant. If one of my beautiful viewers out there is gonna go ahead and give me a hand. So okay, oh, we have spooky tree, and we now have the second egg hatch. How convenient. What is this going to be? Oh, that's dupes though, isn't it? That is. Dang, damn it. Because uh, we had Nipper. Um, oh. So we have already Nipper, so we don't need this guy. I mean, I guess. I mean, you know, I've got nothing against this guy. I'd, but, you know, it's dupes, isn't it? It's dupes. Um... Yeah, so I guess you know, he he's he can chill out for a little bit in the in the uh, in the PC. 
I'm gonna call him Freddy because I've had a I've had a I've had a total dial called Freddy before. Freddy. Anyway, so we've we've we well now that's intriguing. We have a dupe scores there. I'm not gonna go ahead and swap him out for an egg right now because because that we don't want to spend the whole episode just watching me hatch eggs. So what we will go ahead and do is we will put um we'll put both of these into the back into the PC. Spooky Tree and Freddy. Oh look at well you see that's you know that's pretty decent. It's got crunch there, but dude. Um Nipper is just pretty amazing. So but that's okay, I appreciate whoever sent me that. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, I really, really do appreciate that. It's cool. Total dials are all good. But unfortunately, it's dupes right now. So, But it's not going to get lost or, or, or spoilt in any way. Um, I'm keeping all of these Pokemon. And I'm going to be using them um, after the egg lock is finished anyway. So, happy. I'm happy with that. So, let's go ahead and grab me, Boomer. Race car. And, of course... The king of the team, Tesla. Hello, Tesla. Nice to see you back. Okay, so I guess at some point we're going to swap out this guy for another egg. Um, and we'll also, um, off screen, I'll, I'll head back to Parfum Palace and fish there and um, so that I can get another egg. Um, okay, so we're going to get our, we're going to get a game on right now. And that's going to... Oh, do you know what, though? Dang, nam it. We need Surf. But I really don't want to teach Surf to Nipper. Ah, oh, do you know what? Ah, oh, this is maybe where Freddy will come in handy. Maybe we'd go ahead and teach Freddy Surf. And then... Um, he can Surf us where we need to go. Do we need Surf next? We must need Surf down. That must be why Caleb's given us Surf. Um, what level is Nipper? Yeah, okay. So Nipper can just go in there for a moment. Just hold that there for a moment, Nipper. We'll teach uh, We'll teach Freddy Surf. And then Freddy can Surf is where we need to go. Um, Nipper's not going to be missing out on too much XP there because Nipper... You know, we, don't, we wouldn't be fighting... Um, Doll. We won't be fighting water types with um, water types particularly. So, so he can just hold that right there. Right. Okay. So let's go for surf. Let's teach that to Freddy. So Freddy comes through, learn surf, and uh, yeah, surfs is all the places. A level one, a level one Totodile, which can just casually jump on its back. Anyway, you know that's 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 how we roll. That's how we roll. We've spent eight minutes on hatching eggs and. Doing boring stuff like that. Okay, so let's go. Now, I do realise this guy here will give us a Lapras if we want it. Um, I don't suppose it really matters because, uh, again, we're going to be we're going to be swapping out. But will he only give us a Lapras if we have an empty party? That's the question. Oh, I suppose we could have taught Lapras um, Surf, couldn't we? No, we couldn't because it's an Egglock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Yeah, I've got the Rumble Badge, mate. Oh, no, you see. Yeah, I have to free up a slot, so I'm not going to do that. But, you know, you can do that. I'm just going to catch a Pokemon right here. Right here, right now. Um, and this one will also be swapped out for an egg. So we've got all the eggs going on right now, which is pretty cool. And it's a Slowpoke. Eh, uh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Um, I'm going to risk Daramaka going for a yawn. Come on, Boomer. Meow, meow. Meow, meow. Uh, he's using water gun, but we can take that. We can take one. We can take one, surely. Oh, what a boss. Daramaka right there. He's like, yeah. Yeah, it's super effective, but you know what? I'm not even bothered. I don't even care. He's like, Psh, I don't even care. Cool, cool, cool. Anyway, here we go. Tesla! Tesla, come through. I love Tesla. He's so good. Slowpoke's going to try and confuse Tesla, but Tesla's going to be like, not even. You're not even. You're not even. So, Tesla, what are we going to go for? See, the thing is, I don't want to destroy it. I thought ah, it shouldn't destroy it, though, should it? Well, maybe it will. 
Oh, yeah, that's cool. That's cool beans. So we're going to go for a nice and clean great ball next. Sweet. All right. Are we in? Are we in? Let's do this. Come on, come on. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we have a new capture, which is going to be an awesome new egg when we get to the next town, which is the next town. Coomarine Town? Is it Coomarine Town? No names, thank you. I think it might be. Is that where the grass gym is? I love that gym so much. That's like my favourite gym in this gen, I think. Um, I know that loads of people have got loads of love for the psychic gym, but for me, I don't know, it's just, it's a bit weird that one. It's, I much prefer the grass type gym. I like the swinging on the ropes and the, and all of that stuff. That's pretty cool. Okay, well, I'm going to swap out Daramaka from the top of the team because of water types and we're going to give, we're going to give Tesla all the turns. He's going to get all the turns. I'm just going to chill out here, wait for the swimmer. Yo, swimming alone, swimming alone. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm not swimming alone. I'm on top of my level one Freddy because, yeah, he's just hot, hatched out of an egg and able to carry me across the sea. Quillfish. I want to introduce you to Tesla. Um, I'm slightly... Oh, no. I'm slightly scared. We're, under, we're totally underleveled. Um, oh, what? Oh, well. Revenge? You can't revenge me. I didn't hit you. Good grief. Um, good grief. Yeah, I can see, I can see why, uh, why Casey was worried about me taking on the last gym. Because she was like, no, you're not leveled enough. And I'm like, well, I totally, I totally don't care. Just bring it on, bring it on. But now, now I can see. I, I maybe need to do some leveling up. <laughs> nah, come on. You just do this. You just do this. I'm just like, I'm just like, yeah, whatever. Stockpile all the things. Defense is going up, but we're gonna, we're just gonna hit you with this thunder, thunder punch. Come on, do it. Oh nah, nuts. Oh, stockpile again. Stockpile again. How annoying. Actually, you know, they are the moves that I've never used. Stockpile. What is it? Stockpile. S swallow? Spit up? Are they all the ones that are connected together? Possibly. Moxie boost! Come on, Cosmo. You are an absolute boss. And Tesla's levelling up too. Tesla's definitely underleveled. Tesla wants to learn swagger, but we're not going to learn swagger. That's swag play uh, that destroyed um, Frosty earlier on in the Let's Play. That's, that, that's not a nice thing. Um, Binnacle. Binnacle is rock, water. Um, so I guess we're going to go for the drain punch. Rubbish Pokemon. Just the one of the just worst design Pokemon ever. Seriously, just hideous. I mean, I mean, seriously, I mean, I don't say this about many Pokemon because actually I can see the merits in a lot of different Pokemon, but Binacle or Binacle, whatever you want to call it, is just horrendously designed. It's really bad. And uh, oh, that could be our question of the day. <gasps> Hold the phone tesla is evolving oh my goodness oh luxio luxio come through oh i love this poke i love this pokemon so much oh look how cool he is now oh tesla Oh, Tesla, you are just the power. You have the power right now. That was unexpected, but brilliant. Okay, so Tesla leveled up. That's cool beans. We need to do a bit of healing as well right now on Tesla. Uh, Tesla. Brilliant. Oh, yes, that leads nicely into my question of the day, which uh, is going to be, 
Uh, it may as well be. What is your f least favourite Pokemon? You know, the one that you just look at and you just think, seriously? Seriously? Where did that come from? Okay, I know there's going to be people out there voting for stuff like Vanillite. Because it's like, it's like a talking, flipping... A to no, it's not a talking. It's a, it's an, a live ice cream. I mean, seriously, what is that all about? It's ridiculous, right? But no, I think Binacle is one of the worst. That is for sure. So go ahead, drop a comment. What do you think is the worst Pokemon? And I, 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 I feel bad saying it because because I love Pokemon so much. It's like it's like one of my favorite, most favorite things in the whole world. It's Pokemon, but some of them are just terrible. So terrible. Anyway, we have got a Linoon right here. And it's going to use Sand Attack on me. So it's like, yeah, cheers. Yeah, you hope that um, my accuracy is dropped. Because you're going to catch this Drain Punch right now. And um, you're not going to enjoy it. You're not going to enjoy it in the slightest bit. Boom. There you go. So you have a bit of that. Yes, we all know it's super effective. We're going to go for a Brick Break. Saving up some of those Drain Punches for if we need it later on. So we're going for Sand Attack again. Which I guess maybe might mean that we're going to miss. Oh, no. Because Cosmo is a boss. That's pretty awesome. And Cosmo gets the clean level up too, which is brilliant. Need to, uh, I don't even know what uh, level, level Cosmo will evolve. Probably later on because he is. Uh, he only has one level of evolution. So that generally tends to mean that you've got to wait a while. But anywho... Oh no, it's not, it's not, is it what I thought? It's the Skittle! <laughs> check it out, check it out, ready? Ready, here we go. Da, da, da. Get on. La, 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 It's like a thing we have to do now. Everybody, you get on a Skiddo right now. Do, 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 Hopefully, I am not going to follow in the pattern of a um, Pokemon dying and then I and then hopping onto a Skiddo. <laughs> we all know who did that. And if you don't, go and check out uh, Trainer Artie's videos. Her um, Pokemon... Oh, I don't know what it is. X or Y. I can't remember. Her, her uh, Wonderlock series is absolutely hilarious. And you should most definitely check it out. Uh, particularly the episode where she enjoys a nice bit of Skiddo. Um riding and i've got my so here if you um if you uh if you need to if you need a whipped dream is it a whipped dream oh that sounds really really wrong um if you need that to evolve the things or if you need a shiny stone then you know ride yourself a skiddo and uh yeah you can find one Whoop. You can we can also break out of here right now naughty skiddo it's escaping Whoop. Do, 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 do. So if you don't feel like battling trainers, then, you know, you can just skid her past them. Do, 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 Whoop. Straight through there. Whoop. There you go. Happy days. Happy days. Oh, no. I've just uh, got my skiddo stuck up here. Anyway, so do, 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 aren't skiddo amazing. This, this right here is far, far better than riding Rhyhorn on Mama Swine. I'm just saying. Let's put him back. Oh no. There we go. I'm just going to casually put him back. How do I get here? Whoop. There we go. Thanks, kiddo. Right, let's go fight some trainers. Bring it on. I already have a Pokemon from here, right? The um, Slowpoke. Ah, it's a Pachirisu. You know, you little the little guy who really wishes he was um <laughs> he really wishes he was Pikachu, but he's really not. Uh Pachirisu, Pachirisu, catch this night slash right here. Well that's gonna do nothing because my friend Tesla here is the master of electricity. Um he casually works on a death ray in his spare time. I'm gonna oh you're enduring, are you? Wow. I wouldn't have imagined that this Fire Fang is going to do too much damage. Yeah. Um, so we're just going to go for all the Fangs. 
because you know why not why not I feel like we shouldn't have fought this Pachirisu I just I'm concerned that my Pokemon need more levels um which you know which is true which is really true oh and I tell you what right at work today I've been taking like loads of painkillers all day just to get through the day because yes I had a migraine yesterday but also it made me sick which means I've pulled the muscles in my chest again just as they were sort of starting to get better so I was in so much pain this morning so I've just kind of like been back to back taking painkillers all day today and um, I opened one of the packets just totally sliced a big like paper cut on my thumb so it's like it's it's causing me a bit of a oh get lost it's causing me a bit of a problem when I'm trying to play this game. So it's right where the little circle pad is on my 3DS. Anyway, oh look, we have Whitney. Hi Whitney. Do you know what? We're not actually going to fight you because you're really annoying. Oh, you are kidding me. Flipping, trolling me right now. Do you know what I'm going to do? You know what? Oh no, that was a misclick. Oh, for goodness sake. Thank goodness it used bide. Oh my goodness! I'm just gonna get Cosmo out. We're gonna we're gonna maybe drag and dance through the bide if there's another one. How many how many turns is bide? Three, two or three, two bides and then a hit. Well, he's not been hit by anything yet, so your bide is just gonna flop majorly. We're gonna go for the drag and dance drain punch combo. Ah ha ha! You miss me because you stupid milk tank. Okay, so, drain punch. Yeah, you can bide all you like, but I've got two turns here. You're not going to survive two turns. See? See, I told you, you're not going to survive two turns, mate. Brilliant. Well done, Tesla. Let's heal you up. Let's heal you up. Okay, okay. Let's do the potion. Cool beans. Right, I want to get to the end of this route, hopefully. Fight all the trainers here. Um, and then... Um, and then I'll probably end up the episode. So, I'm, I'm about to find out how strong her family is. She's about to find out how strong I am. Pokemon breeder, Am... Amla? Amla? Amla's got a survivor. What's that then? What's that then, Survivor? What are you? Survivor, oh, we're so underleveled right now. It's poison type, right? I may have made a massive mistake. Is it poison dark type? <laughs> there's like some Pokemon I'm totally familiar with, and there's some Pokemon that I'm just like totally not familiar with. Survivor is one of them. Never really used a Survivor. Um, and I'm just going by the fact that it looks like a snake, that it's poison type. Um, I'm hoping that race car's going to come through here. Oh, glare. That's okay, that's what? Low lowering our speed? Oh, paralyzing. Oh, crap, Sax. Come on. Right, poison fang, you can hold that. You can take that. Holy crap, it was a crit. That's okay, though, because that's going to take Survivor out. Good grief. Is uh, race car's defence not that great? Do I need to be aware of that? Um, well, he's re um, she's levelling up now, which is cool beans. Quite like having a psychic type on the team. It's always helpful, I reckon. Oh, hello, Miltank. I am going to um, introduce you to one of my friends. He's right here, and he would love to see you. His name is Cosmo. And he has this 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 move that I think he will he will really he th really thinks that you're going to appreciate. Um, it's called Drain Punch. Should I set up there? Nah, just Drain Punch. Just Drain Punch. I mean, you know, is um is Dragon Dance Drain Punch? Is that what I should do every time? Oh, are you gonna go for rollout? Are you? Such a shame. It's not very effective. Yeah, I think I should Dragon Dance Drain Punch every time. Um, that's cool, that's cool. We can... I think we'll be alright. I think we'll be alright. Rollout's going to increasingly do damage, but Cosmo avoided the attack anyway because he's like a boss. Oh, I love this Cosmo. I really do. Um, 
We'll go for a brick break at the end, just saving up those drain punches. Let's go for a body slam, but again, we should be okay. And the brick break is going to take out that mill tank. Mill tank, which is awesome sauce. Ace. And Cosmo levels up, which is cool beans. And I've defeated that Pokemon, Breeder. And we're going to roll on and see what we can find next. And we have a little kid. My swarm of bug type Pokemon is in tip top shape and buzzing for a battle. Well, um, I'd like to introduce you to my friend Tesla. Um, he he is uh, he is um, electric type, but he knows Fire Fang too. Um, but what is Yanmar? Is Yanmar Flying Bug? So will this th will this Thunder Fang be be cool? Oh, it is! It's super cool, <laughs> super cool. Tesla, oh, I love Tesla. Butters, can I just put two thumbs up to you for giving me Tesla? Tesla is like the best, the best present ever. I mean, I'm not. Honestly, I have to say thumbs up to everybody who's given me eggs because so far I've hatched some such amazing Pokemon. Seriously, I couldn't have asked for better Pokemon in this Let's Play. Um, I think that's probably the reason why things are going so kind of well because Pokemon I've got are actually really well bred and um, just generally pretty cool. I'm going to go into Boomer right now because um, Fire type. And we haven't seen Boomer. Let's, let's get Boomer out. Let her, let her do a little little dance right now. We've got Whirlipede coming out, but um, uh, Boomer can catch it with a fire punch. Oh, look how powerful that is. That is so powerful. Boom. All the things. And a moth in. Well, you know what? Um, I'm just gonna keep uh, Boomer in because I, I reckon that fire punch is just gonna it's just gonna be awesome to awesome sauce again. Let's do it. Let's do this thing right now. Oh yeah, haha! <laughs> Boomer is so powerful. As long as Boomer is faster um, and he doesn't get hit by anything, or she doesn't get hit by anything too hard, then I think she'll be okay. She's just a bit frail, but so uh, no, I'm happy, happy with that. So we beat the youngster. Is there one more guy up here? Get up here. Yeah, it's a guy here. Oh, no. Oh, no. I was like, I totally need to um, I totally need to heal up race car. Let's hope we don't need race car for this battle. We've got Pokemon Breeder Foster. He's got a Zangoose. So I guess we really could do with... Hang on, what is Zangoose? Normal or fighting? I don't even know. I can't even remember. Um, I'm not even sure. Do you know what? I'm not even sure what it what he is. Normal type. I have to really look this up. I can't quite remember. Are you switch into. Ah, oh, do you know what? I'm going to switch into Kevin because Kevin is just powerful. He can take hits and um, we can set up the wish as well if we need to. And also he has got, he's the highest level. So you know what, if in doubt, Kevin's coming out. Let's go for the Dreading Kiss and see what it does. Probably not too much. Ah, that's pretty cool. That's That was better than I thought it was going to be as well. So that's nice. Uh, he's going to use Revenge. It's a fighting type move, so <laughs> Kevin's not even bothered. He's like, I'm so not bothered. He's like, look at my face. Does it look bothered? No. No. Okay, cool. And Kevin's leveled up as well, which is brilliant. Is that the last trainer? Oh no, it's not. We've got a Tauros. Tauros. Well, um, you know what? 
Cosmo's got to come out here. I'm scared about what Taurus has got, though, to be honest. Um, I'm going to go straight in for the Drain Punch because we do need... Oh, rat bags. Um... No, that's possibly a bad idea. No, that's not going to do anything, though, because we are dark type. Right, let's do this. I'm going to do it again. Oh, he's bulking up too, which is interesting. Um, Come on, let's do this. Right, we're going to go for the drain punch next. We need to get back some of that, that HP that we're down on. And we made ourselves faster too, which is cool. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. That's clean, that is clean, that is. It's working up again, but hopefully... Hopefully we're not going to feel the... We're not going to feel the wrath of that work up. Because we're just going to... Oh, I should have gone for Brick Break. That was like a misclick there, totally. Okay, so, but anyway, that it doesn't even matter because that Taurus is gone. Cosmo's like gaining loads more XP and we've defeated the Breeder Foster. Uh, I'm, I'm a jinx. No. I'm a jinx wherever I go. Okay, so, here we go. I know there's a fisherman guy down there, but it doesn't even matter because we are in Kumarine City. And we've received a hollow clip. Who is it going to be? Oh, it's Caleb. Oh, he wants, he wants, he's calling us out right now. Beck, I challenge you to a battle in front of the gym. You better be ready. I'm ready. I was born ready. Okay, so guys, thank you very much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button and uh, don't forget to answer the question of the day or just leave me a comment in the comment section below. Um, I would really appreciate, if you, if you haven't already, if you could subscribe to my channel. Um, all the subs count and uh, every one of them puts a really happy smiley smile on my face. That didn't come out right. Um, you can also head over to Twitter and you can give me a follow there too. Just so you can keep up to date with my Wonder Trades and... Uh, my videos and once again i apologize for no one trading this week um it was just one of those things but i will be back bigger and better next wednesday with some dinos some bronzos and something else some talos which are all five ivs i'll probably also have some five iv spritzy some five iv sneezles and some 5 IV shinks with and they all have egg moves. So I will see you next time guys. Um take care and uh, yeah, see you soon. <laughs>